All right, we're back with Lumpity Humps. Lumpity Humps. Is Lumpity Humps better than Humpity Lumps? I don't know. Was this the... Oh. If you're following his visions, his visions of his Lumpity Humps. My, my lumps, my lumps. My Lumpity lump Lumpity Humps. humps. Yeah. <laughs> He's singing as well. He's just singing a more slowed down version of it. His lovely janitor humps. Uh, also, to totally date this video, because you'll be able to figure out the date of when we recorded it based off of this information. Mm -hmm. Allegedly, we just passed 70,000 views on our channel. Well, oh. Allegedly. Total Until channel YouTube views. updates. I mean... And takes all that away. Sure. I don't think... Do, do they take away views don't like that? Don't they adjust? Don't they adjust? Potentially. That's why I'm trying to actually go to the channel to see. Um, do to try and fly across here? Uh, maybe I'm wrong. It's 701,000 views. What was that email? Yeah, it was 700,000. Yeah, so 700,000 views. Sorry. So we've got 700 and 1,030 views. I, just, I got an email about it and I apostrophes moved around. It's also interesting that you get emails about it. Uh, yeah. I get lots of emails about lots of things. Very few of them are about dyslexia. Emails. Um, I the used to be... Oh, sorry, what? No, I was gonna say, the the videos that tend to date us are like the shorts where we have like, we're at like set amount of subscribers and then I just think, yeah, we're not at that anymore. Yeah. But sure dates us when you really look at it. Yes. But you were going to say something? I was gonna say, um, you, I used to be one of those people who was like, okay, I need to like just filter emails to where they're, they're folders and those kinds of things, like not delete anything, eventually it'll all be handy. Now, like 90% of the emails I get, I'm just like, oh, that's good information, delete. Mm hmm The ones I like are the spam ones. Of, uh, What's gotten in here too? like apparel, whatnot. <laughs> yes. We can help you I usually just like look at them and, yeah. Whoa! Whoa! Where'd Whoa. those guys come from? Just down the hall. Oh, they're the they're just shambling towards you. You should have. You should have fixed the mold. Yeah, I don't know what it is about like those spam emails that I just get curious of. What are you selling to what us the, today? Where did the, what the holy, the holy explodey? You just keep your, coming from every direction. Your lumps just got humped. We require consent. You, yes, consent is important. Otherwise, you explode. The mold's gotten in here too. Are, like, is something on the wall like a spawner or something like that you gotta take out? No. It doesn't look like it. But it's possible what happened is you killed guys that spawned other guys. It's still weird to me that you can throw the bodies, like... Not that rock, apparently. <laughs> you can break it, though. 
Also, you hit a dude with like a plastic folding chair and it nearly kills him. You hit a dude with a rock and it's like half his life. Totally inconsistent in the damage from the objects you throw. Uh, you getting spored? Yes. I yeah, I've been hit. Ah, lights. Ding the bell. We've kind of got this place something. figured out. Oh, uh, uh, you gotta break the pus balls. I don't wanna. That's gross. Yeah. Doesn't don't. mean you don't do that. I, last time I said when you've got a pimple, you just gotta pop it. You were like, no, you don't do that. Don't listen to me. Da -da 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 -da. And now you're reversing it. No, I'm saying in real life, you shouldn't be popping pimples. It provides scarring and more gross acne to continue spawning. Okay, radios. Puss and radios. And more radios. Something happen? It sounded like it. Did it destroy the pus in the first room? Oh, looks like it did. But what did uh, you do? Did you pop the radio? Turned off the radios on. Turned off the. Yeah, oh. He popped the pimples. And now. Out through the triangle door, or out through ooh, through one of the other doors, or the door at the end of the hall. There's a door at the end of the hall. Janitor, the janitor's door makes sense. Wait. You're off the map. You're in the janitor's mind. I thought you just exited the painting, though. Did you not exit the painting? Yes, you did exit the painting. But I said follow his visions, so I assume you're in his brain. But, but I think I you're also now in the corner. The visions. I don't know. Let's start. Wait, no, 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 never mind. Is this where the obelisk from 2001 came from? Watch out, there's a Tim. They're not so good at dodging their friends. He can go be good at shooting his friends. I can't go up high enough. Dun dun dun. Dun dun dun. So close. Just just a little short. To go up the crane. So is the quarry how they fund this whole operation? They sell, like, countertops? Maybe like even flooring. Probably some shower tiles. Maybe even showers themselves. Not just the know. tile. I've never seen like a shower pipe that was 
made out of rock. I, mean, I guess technically copper is a rock, or was a rock at one point in time, right? It's an ore, but I don't know if that counts. It was around rocks. It was part of rocks. Oh, that light, I thought was the bottom. I, there's a copper rock that is a rock that contains copper ore. But does it, is it still a rock once it's been processed? Hold on. Maybe this one is definitely is an element this is a mineral. This is for science. Is. This is for this is definitely science. The last time you were looking things up for science, it wasn't science. It was science. Where did all my blue things go? Science took them. They got transplanted into someone else. Hmm. Yes, curious. It just, apparently it just, native copper is an element and a mineral. It doesn't say it's a rock. Yeah, it a it's rock. not a rock. It's not a rock. Rocks, minerals? I don't know. It just says native copper is a mineral and not a rock of any sort, as some might say it is. So it looks like they're targeting you specifically with that. I, mean, I, I, I didn't say it was a rock. I was asking if it was a rock. Let's see. It's mineral a rock. Minerals are not rocks, and rocks are not minerals. Well, but then what's a rock? A rock is an inorganic solid and natural substance without any specific atomic structure or chemical composition. It is simple to remember that rocks are made up of two or more minerals. So a rock is not a mineral, but minerals are rocks. Yes. No. No. Rocks, no. rocks are made up of minerals. Yes. Let's say. Yeah. Examples like, of rocks involve limestone, granite, marble, slate, and sandstone. Each of these rocks consists of different minerals that can be mixed up with the with the rock through different geological processes. A mineral is defined as a natural inorganic solid substance which has a crystalline structure with a particular chemical composition. A mineral is said to possess different chemical composition which defines its crystalline shape and form. Whereas a rock which is said to be comprised of several minerals is generally classified based upon the process of its formation. Sounds to me like whoever wrote this thing up did a lot of pushing their glasses up and saying, um, actually. Yeah. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, gondola. Oh, you can pick up a forklift? You got stronger. You couldn't pick up that one rock, though. But you can pick up a forklift. <laughs> And it just veers oh. <laughs> off to the left, apparently. And, to... and we didn't figure out how to set things down, right? Like, you have to fling them, right? I think so. So you can't just set that onto your... Whoa! Whoa! Oh. No. Goodbye forever. Goodbye forever. That wasn't the put-down button. That was not... I mean, it was technically a put-down button. Also, this just popped back into my head from... Before I don't know if it was this episode or the last episode we were talking about getting slapped in the face and I was talking about yes. getting slapped by because I Someone, made fun of Leonardo DiCaprio yeah and you had mentioned that you've been slapped in the face too many times yes which totally not surprising having known you as long as I have you know what you know what's funny though in regards to that I did not deserve any of those slaps in the face and that's actually being very truthful and knowing like the situation I did not deserve them. I mean, I've seen you slap someone. Yes. And anyone who follows that channel, if it's still even around and active, will have seen it as well. It's hilarious. I did feel really bad for it because he ended up with a headache. And... He asked for I it. I know... 
I know, I know he asked for it. He, it was, and, consent, and, consent and it's not, was it's not, definitely involved. I was going to say, it, it's not like, oh, he asked for it, like, he was talking trash. No, yeah, he like he literally wanted it for this video, the video yeah, that. Will you slap me, and then we'll record it in slow motion. And it took months of it, too. It wasn't just, oh, yeah, sure, I'll do it, because I really didn't want to slap him, but he's like, no, I want to do it for a video. And I was like, dude, I really don't want to slap you, because I know it's going to hurt. But I really want to do it for a video. I was like, no, it's gonna hurt. And then finally one day, I can't remember what he had said, but I was like, all right, fine, well, I'll slap you. And it you'll was, stop asking me about it. It was almost like the Rick James slap in the Chappelle show, like down towards the table. Yeah. And then was, the the one that always gets me is um, up ahead. his partner, his it? reaction of like, oh, yeah. If you're curious, it's the V12 lifestyle. Yeah. I can't remember what video it was on, but. Somewhere on there. Search that. Yeah. Although that might give out too even, much information. Not... What was that? That might give out too much personal information. It might. I was going to say, though, it's not like in the video itself. It's within like the first, hey, what, no, 10 no. seconds? A little gag that we did for those videos. Holidays. But. Whoa. Uh, cool. Beach scene? Ah! Oh, and there's your chair. Oh, man. Stabs you in the back. Did you have peace in your soul? Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, no, no. It's not the hiss, it's the piss. They cut it all wrong. Take my cassette player. It's just a miscommunication. The song is a present from my friends to you. It will get you through the maze so you can do your job. Okay. So apparently you just need music to get through the maze? Did that really just happen? Of course it did. He gave me his cassette player. It'll get me through the maze, huh? Glad that they gave you this right here after whatever the hell just happened. Yeah. Yeah. Now to the maze. To the maze. How do I equip the... Did you just put it on? Yep. Cool. Probably, definitely not going to get a copyright strike for this. I turned no. off the copyright music thing. Did it? Yeah. I mean, they are singing the words control, so maybe they this is part of the game and they're cool with it? We'll find out if we get flagged for it. Oh, TV! Oh no! <laughs> you just pluck it out of the air. It's also kind of funny to imagine the janitor listening to this as he's just sweeping the floor or mopping. I'm going to be really disappointed if we get flagged for it, because this song is kind of awesome. So yeah, there is, from the game, I just found a tweet, I was just looking up to see if this song was... Copyrighted? Copyrighted or not. It says, if you didn't already know, Control has the option to mute copyrighted music so you can play without worry of DMCA strikes, which is great, but... There's a Is door. This... Okay. Yeah. For anyone who has seen the labyrinth, this is kind of what is bringing vibes. I mean, this whole game is kind of that, yeah? That's true, but it's just because you got the guy who's singing and you're trying to find your way through the labyrinth as a female protagonist. That's what this reminds me of. Uh, 
I really hope this music is cool to play, because it's some killer music. It is. And it actually fits the theme of what you're doing, and I don't want it to be as empty as it was for the Max Payne video. That one that we had to mute a section out of. Yeah. Because we were talking about garlic. Things. Well, not just that one, but the end, the end song. Oh, the end song, yeah. The Where end song was actually really cool. Yeah, and it it made that whole fight scene less interesting. Uh, it also made me go through the fight scene. <laughs> it was kind of interesting, <laughs> but yeah. made me go through the whole fight scene a lot quicker than I normally would have. It's like this action hero montage sequence where you're just running through fighting enemies with the dramatic music playing in the background. It is kind of awesome. <laughs> And here's, and to be fair, this is Reddit now. Yeah. So, yeah. Crane Assault. But somebody yeah. just asked what happens if you turn that option on, the no copyright music, um, what happens during this section? And the response is it's not replaced. The song was made for the game, so it plays as normal. So. Oh, well, that's nice. That's actually really good. Although somebody is saying that they uploaded a small section on YouTube to show a friend and it got automatically copyrighted. Yeah, I think with a lot of things like that, it's uh, very specific on how you have. Because like if you do like, um, I watch true crime channels on YouTube and like Dr. Phil's like a no 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 don't use my my stuff but other channels depending on how it's used can use Dr. Phil content so it just kind of depends on how you're doing it all I can say is if it gets flagged I'll just be really sad oh, Bye, Nugget. No. Oh no! Oh, now the electric guitar kicks in. This is such an epic sequence. Aww, and oh, then it just... now it's gone. That's, That's disappointing. Awesome. Yes! She said it. it. Yeah, <laughs> I'm glad that she agrees. The expedition into Slidescape 36. What darling brought back. Yeah, we'll find out. Yeah, you want me here. Finding the projector was how this all began. What Dylan started projector. in ordinary ends here. You, me, Dylan. We've all come full circle. Was this like the end? Maybe. How far, how far into the game are we? I mean, it kind of seemed like we started in the middle of the game. This place looks there was a door dusty. 
to where Dylan and I went, where the projector took us, where we met you. The bureau. I mean that we've recorded this game for looks like um, about nine, ten hours. So I don't remember how long we kind of Just deemed this game side. was going to be. Does that include the hours of running around trying to find things? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I can't, you know, uncalculate that Stand yet. Stand away from frame. Do, 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 do. Don't know why the Jurassic Park theme just got stuck yeah. in my head. Yeah. And you started doing that, and I started realizing where you were going with it. The projector. Is that What's going to happen? Just a box. The projector's not I'm going to be the object of power now. What did Darlene look at do me, look at it? me. I'm the object of power. I've got to find out. It's been moved. It's inside Dylan. He just pulls out of his stomach. What's the point of that? To so probably shut off the projector from projecting. The text on it. Color slide film. This side. Search the area for the slide projector. Object of power. Object of power. It's also great how you're like off to the side of the map. Yeah. And how the astral maze is still just question mark. It's all just because you can't map it. Do do. Oh, I don't have my weapon. I wonder if this is important to hit. Oh crap! Oh, Rubik's cube. That it? No, he needs one more on the right. Expedition 3. We located the source of the resonance in Slidescape 36. Oh, it okay. Is an entity. Slidescape 36. A organism of That's what I thought. A considerable mass. I I've named it <laughs> Hedron Big bad based guy. on its physical shape. Hedron. <laughs> we, we, we built a Was that for it. you? Did he bring you here? Is that why you brought me here? I mean, those things keep popping up, You're like, here. is it supposed to be talking to you? You're here. They have you. I know you. I remember her from Ordinary. I thought I'd never see you again. Hang on, I'm coming. I'm confused. Uh, I I think it's because you're living with someone in your mind, and so the person in your mind's probably the one that's talking. At this like point, you're I'm living normal. with an alien. Ooh. You are coming through so strong. Can you like hover in? HRA to lock the door. I have to rip it off to get in. Oh no. Are you sure? Okay, I'll be there. Hang on. Okay, that works. Is it just gonna be a twist where the person guiding you the whole time is really just the bad guy? Probably. Oh, it fell on me. End of game. 
Game over. Hi. I made it. Dun dun dun. This is awkward. Cleanse the uh, siphons. I'm gonna do that. Probably touch him. Yeah, probably touch him. Gotta F him. Oh, but it's a so long, long one. Yeah. Good thing you have a friend on your side. Whoa, language, Jesse. There are adults present. And only adults, because this is adult-only channel. I mean, right now, during the recording, there are no children present. Just saying. Must <laughs> one of you guys have something hidden somewhere? Something no, hidden somewhere. make it! Oh, that's a, an amazing catchphrase, action hero catchphrase there. Especially when it's needed. Oh, needing help. Nice, you can take cover when you take those dudes over. Yeah, as Shut long up. as you have cover to take. Yeah. Run! Run! Is that the last one? There were only three? Weren't there four? Like, isn't this the fourth one? Sure. Not sure if it was three or four. Nope, just three. Alright. Max Headroom no. is freed? Oh, is there wait, one more? Looks like there's one more. Oh, changed. Oh, he hit him. He picked up the blue. It's one of those Sonic the Hedgehog dudes. Gotta go fast. Quick. He's healing. I think that those Healy guys heal him. There's Healy orb dudes. dudes. The orb dudes are Healy dudes? I think so. Hit it! Do, 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 oh. Do. Yeah, yeah. Come on. Rocket Man. Rocket Man. Hit the wrong one. I was like, if you could take over the Healy dude, would he have healed you? That's <laughs> helpful. Kick him. There's a Rocket Man behind you. I'm going for it. Oh, no. oh you were so close. Oh. You think it'll give it to me? No. Because <laughs> I think you were like a sliver away before they hit you. Oh, you kind you of picked up the out. fish then. Why can't you just pick up the one you need to get rid of. Floaty man, floaty man, floating all over the place. 
Oh, jeez. Yes. Taste of his own medicine. Floaty man versus floaty man. One floaty man enters, two floaty men enter, one leaves. One enters, two leaves somehow. That works. That, that works. Is that all of them? I think that's all of them. Hopefully. Then what do you want to bet? There's like three more of these as you go. I think there's a lot more. Oh, change the recaps phrase. Just trying new things, workshopping it. Oh, I can't. No, there it goes. Ooh. <laughs> I couldn't move my mouse. <laughs> Make it all the way over there? I'll try. These Healy Rocket dudes. Also, remember you can charge up your explodey gun. Yeah, I know. Holy crap! There you go. Oh, jeez. That was violent. It's great that you got to now go even further, or can you just Higher fly up, yeah. up from really like this is the punishment for dying? Is having to re travel back to where you were. Just, yeah, just walking back to where you happened to be before. That floor, I guess that's your fast way up? Yeah. What? What? <laughs> he <laughs> blew it up. It just. Like. He shot it as you were going to hit him with it. Makes perfect sense. No! Made. Whoa, is there above you? Where'd you go? Above and behind you. So where's the fast way? You just keep going straight. There's like a one of those pillars starts moving up and down, I think. You have to time it. Oh no, there it is. There's like that awkward. Oh, that's, oh, uh, that's a cool. <laughs> Three guys just yeah. standing there waiting for yeah. you to pop up. Yeah. Oh no! Alright, time to regroup. <laughs> go the other way. Uh, Probably have to go back up. It's also weird that it's like you can hover, but only just so high. Well, you don't get to be Superman. Seems to me like levitation is levitation. Like, why is there a limit on it? You're already overcoming gravity. It's the brain power. Oh, it's 
a deputy. You're only supposed to shoot the sheriffs, not the deputies. Oh, yeah. Floating chairman! I need help! Seems like there's just all of a sudden a lot of people. When that thing explodes, watch out. Ah. It's behind you. you. You've trained yourself now to run straight ahead. It does make me wonder if this is really the end of the game. And so ideally they we're probably thinking you're gonna have more points and whatnot, abilities that you've upgraded. Yeah, you were supposed to grind another 10 hours worth of game. You do have a lot of side missions that might be the answer, but. Rock at him. Throw their Have friends your friend. at them. Here. Take my wife. No, please, take her. Looks like that dude might spawn other people in. Well, he's like, like a satellite, dish a satellite to, the face. to the face. Did he come back though? No, I think there's two, two different guys that show up. Oh, there's two different deputies. It's good that guy telegraphs where his attacks are gonna be. <laughs> Sneaky sniper. Snipers. Yeah, yeah, that's who was getting you before. High ground. See the. There you go. First try. First try. Totally. First it's totally try. The first try. Now cue ten more rounds of this. <laughs> it's as bad as the library from uh, Halo, the first one. <laughs> yeah, yep, yep. You know, it, it, we assumed there was going to be more of them. Yeah. Lots more of them. Kidding? <laughs> you have to destroy it first, and then you can take the original satellite. Like, you can't shoot a bomb at it or something. Yeah. You have to break its cage. You have to break its cage. You gotta break its rusty cage. be awesome if it was that easy. There were just yeah, like those three finished. dudes over there. So you get over there. Yeah. Though, it's going gonna, it's gonna to kick gonna off. Spawn. He's getting his dishes ready. Uh, yeah, I would too. He saw through your trap. There's two tough men up there. Yeah. Hmm. 
Oh, I thought that yes. you were pulling that thing. Oh my gosh! With two of them, it's gonna be <sighs> double tough. We'll be done and there's maybe another episode, or we'll be done and somehow change clothes and keep going. Yeah. You'll know when this comes out. So. You'll know when we know. You'll know. Yes, exactly at the exact same time <laughs> that we know. Yep. <laughs> anyway, adios. See ya.